Please come with me. Let's go to Colossians chapter 3, verse 25. And if you have a Bible or your phone, go to this scripture here so you will know that I am not making anything up. You know, I am not tripping. Just come with me. Okay. But he that doeth wrong, he or she, but he that doeth wrong shall receive for the wrong which he hath done. So some people believe that as long as they believe in God, they can continue to do whatever they like. They can continue to sin. But what this is telling me in Colossians 3 and 25, whoever does wrong, they will receive payment or a punishment for what they have done. But he that doeth wrong shall receive for the wrong which he hath done. So that means that you are going to receive a punishment. Some people say that God is a God of love. God would never ever punish me, Kevin. Obviously, you are not reading the Bible. Many people aren't. Okay, and there is no respect of persons. So you may say to me, hey, Kevin, what does respect of persons mean? There is no favoritism. Like, hey, you know, God is not going to say, hey, I really like Joe, but Jane, <laughs> I am going to curse her. <laughs> Joe, man, you can pretty much do whatever you want to. But Jane, man, you mess up one time, I am going to lay the hammer down. No, there is no favoritism. Does that make any sense? So yes, God is a God of love, but he is a God of punishment too. You are going to reap whatever you sow. So please show this to people. Take them to Colossians 3 and 25. There is no once saved, always saved. No, you have to repent. Because, well, even when you repent, you are still going to receive punishment for what you have done wrong. But at least if you die after you repent or you live by God's rules, you are going to heaven. But we still have to pay for the wrong that we do in life. So when many bad things are happening to you, what is going on? <laughs> Why are so many bad things happening to me? Life is not fair. Look at your life. What are you doing? What are you saying? What are you contemplating on? Think about that. Because I used to think the same way too. Like, why are so many bad things happening to me? Like, I think that I am a semi-good person. But I started to look at, yeah, <laughs> I was treating people like trash. I was a very hateful person. So once I started to change, I started to see, hey, not as many bad things are happening to me now. <laughs> Go figure. <laughs> so I pray this makes sense. God bless.